All right, y'all, I got to water the garden. We ain't had any rain here in Nashville. Get soaking in a good while. And yesterday it reached, uh, well, the temperature in the car was showing 100 degrees. So I've got to water the garden. And then I'm going to till all this up here in the next few days. But I got to water the garden while it's real early. It's about 7 o'clock in the morning right now. And uh, get some water on these uh, tomatoes and things. <music> And it's another beautiful day here in Nashville. We're not in Nashville. Well, in Mount Juliet. <laughs> Man, it feels good out here right now. Of course, it's early in the morning. Look, I gotta get my tarp. I didn't put that back on yesterday. We grilled again. And Janina said at some point high winds came by and blew my tarp way over there for my grill. You can see it right there. So, uh, yeah. I didn't know it did it. You said, man, did you hear those high winds? I, I said, I didn't hear nothing. I was actually inside, I think, uh, editing the video from yesterday. All right, y'all. So, Jenny is going to work on the kitchen here. And then I got to do some things myself here in a bit. Hello, Archie. He, Archie was not feeling good uh, yesterday morning. And so, he kind of spit up in a couple of areas here on the carpet, as you can see right here. So, I got to get the carpet cleaned out and clean that up and uh clean parts of the carpet there but uh so yeah and check this out guys jenny made this yesterday she uh made these little hearts with the cat's name on it there's jinx and mama hello archie and uh, <laughs> uh Aini and archie i think that says king mom 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 <laughs> that's nom 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 that's what? Nom, nom, nom. This oh. Is their, this is their feeding station. Gotcha. Okay. This so, is meow. Yeah, meow. Meow. There's Jinx. There's Jinx. And she's the princess that's underneath yeah. it. Yeah. So, and she made that right there above uh, their bowls. But, uh, and plus, later today, I'm going to show you uh, some of her other projects that she crafts that she made you're gonna be I think amazed at uh, what she made you're gonna think that definitely she went somewhere and bought this but uh, she did not and I'll show those to you a little bit later all right y'all so excuse the mess but this is the main project for today this right here is a spare bedroom that we kind of turned into an office slash storage room I guess you can say and of course this is a lot of food that uh, we collected um, I guess during the pandemic of last year Janita's canning stuff that she she oh, loves canning look what and I did and I am so proud of this I can chicken canned chicken just like the canned stuff you go buy on the shelf so she made it herself so that's pretty awesome but look she, I mean she's got pinto beans and and black eyed peas corn diced tomatoes diced tomatoes she I mean, chow chow, you name it, pickles, carrots, she did it all. Green beans down here. Green you beans, feel. you can't see it because of the mess, but uh, jam, jelly. she makes her own, yeah, jelly and jam, all that stuff. So uh, it, it actually saves a lot of money when you do this, but um, it is a process. And one day when she does this, I'll show it to you. But uh, so yeah, so this uh, is another little table we got over here. Just a little temporary table uh, we set up. But there's my computer where I, where I edit uh, my videos. And then I got another table right over here where I actually work with my computer and files and things. So uh, yeah, there's a lot to getting straight. And, and through here is the laundry room. It's full of stuff. And now you need to go ahead and show because this is real life. Oh. <laughs> Real life, guys. This is it. I don't know if you can see. This is what I'm working on. Ta-da! I mean, look, we got stuff. Jenny stores a lot of our Christmas stuff in here. There's those shark vacuum I was telling you we had. Uh, right there. The shark. And through there is the laundry room. I got stuff hanging up in there from where we washed yesterday. So, yeah, we got a lot of stuff to do. Um yeah <laughs> well it is time to vacuum again when you have four cats inside 
they keep fur all over the place. We have to vacuum about twice a day. So while Janita is in the back straightening all that mess up we just showed you a little while ago, I'm going to vacuum, help her out, do uh, all that. I try to help her out on the uh, housework when I can. Uh, so let's do it. So vacuuming in the living room and dining room is done and down the hallway. Uh, now a lot of times I don't get to do this because I'm working during the day, but I'm on, happen to be on vacation the rest of the week, so that's why I'm able to help Janita out. Usually she's the one doing all this, bless her heart. But uh, yeah. So you remember how I showed you, told you yesterday, how cool this is when you empty it out. See all this, man. This is mostly cat fur and stuff that it picked up. I don't know if you can see that on this side. You really see it here. So I told you yesterday it's got this little handle right here. You push forward, it ejects everything out into the trash can. Check this out. And that's that. All right, y'all. If you have carpets anywhere in your house, you definitely need one of these here. This is the Hoover Power Dash Pet. Uh, carpet cleaner uh, It's pretty small, but it's perfect for spot cleaning, which is what I'm gonna do here today uh, as you, I don't know if you can see it on camera. We got some spots right here and I think right here and a couple of other areas uh, where Archie was not feeling good yesterday yesterday morning and uh, Spit up it didn't really throw up but kind of spit up and I tried clean it, but the, it kind of stained it so this right here will get it right up quickly. And uh, and this is a great little machine, guys. I mean, they're fairly cheap. I think you can get them for $80 or something like that. Um, it's so dirty. Look at it. We need to clean it. I need to clean it up. But <laughs> that's the thing about carpet cleaners, man. They get dirty. So I take this apart uh, after each time I use it and clean it out the brush and all that crap. Yeah, but it's <clears> the outside. Look at it. Yeah. So anyways, guys, uh, I'm going to do some spot cleaning here and get these spots right up. It won't take but probably five, six minutes. <laughs> Just like that, it's done. All right, so I gotta boil some water because the hummingbird feeders are about empty. And uh, we don't want the little birds to go thirsty, do we? All right, so the water is a boiling, so we will turn this off. And then we will get our water and pour it into our pre-measured measuring cup of sugar. And you want about the same amount of sugar of in ounces as water that you have. So these uh, hummingbird feeders each hold uh, six ounces of water. So a total of 12 ounces for two of them. So I got uh, about that much in sugar and in water. So I'll just stir this up real good until the water is pretty much clear. And then uh, we'll let it cool down to room temperature. And then we'll go fill up the uh, feeders. All right, so we got a lot of hummingbirds in the backyard as well that we just discovered. And so I'm going to take one of these feeders down and move it to the backyard. We got two of them. And as you can see, they're almost empty. Not much. Uh, hello there, Hummer. <laughs> oh, good. He's like, what are you going to do with my feeder? What are you doing? So I'm going to move it to the backyard. Let's go. He's like, oh no, you're taking my feeder away. That's beautiful outside today, man. I mean, look how, look at this. You can probably hear the, uh, all the cicadas, man. How noisy they are. And last night, Janita was on the back deck. And uh, 
they flew into her and stuff. I heard her screaming, ah, get away from me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's quite funny. It's all right. Man, was that, was that a Hummer? Uh, I was telling them about uh, these cicadas that landed on you last night. <laughs> All right, so I think this hummingbird is following me because when I took it down, he was flying around me. So we are going to hang this one. Let's see, we got to get it kind of high. That's the hummers. Find a good steady branch. There we go. What about that? What about that? Yeah, I may have to break that branch off right there, but uh, I think that's going to work. I'm gonna break that branch and then uh, should be good to go. And we got a tin can here that we use for BB gun practice. <laughs> Meanwhile. All right, let's go in the back here and see what kind of progress Janina's made. Holy schmoly. <laughs> Ooh, stuff everywhere. Wow. Stuff is piled up, can't even walk. Yeah, that's all the stuff she's talking about, but it's cleared out in here, but man, look at all this. All right, probably by the end of the day, I'll be back together looking good. <laughs> all right, so it is lunchtime, so I am going to eat me some good old pizza rolls. I love these things. I can eat my weight in them. <laughs> all right, oven has preheated. Let's plop these bad boys in here. Woo. All right. All right. And we will come back to those when uh, they start losing out. They're ready to go. And they're done. All right, y'all. So I'm now going to shampoo the carpet here. We keep the litter box for the cats uh, right here. We used to keep it in the back room there, but that's now my office and things. So the cats would get in there and knock off my files and things and mess with my uh, laptop. So uh, we had to put the litter box here at the end of the hallway. We put towels down to catch the litter uh, when they step out of the uh, litter box. But uh, it needs to be shampooed. Uh, so that's what I'm going to do right now. 20 minutes later. After all that, I think I deserve a treat. Don't that look good? Hmm? Oh, look at that. Get you some of that. <laughs> All right, y'all. Janita says she is done. Mission complete. Let's go check it out. Nice. Very nice. All right. Look how cleared out it is now. Awesome. Hey, I can actually walk in here now. Very nice, babe. Check the closet. Oh, she wants to check the closet. Let's check the closet, shall we? Alright! I can walk! Yeah, I know. We got a lot of stuff, guys, but uh, it's organized. Alright! And we got clothes in the washer. <laughs> Looks good, babe. Very good. All right, y'all. So Janita has started crafting. And what she does, she goes and buys, goes and buys these books. Uh, a, dollar a, tree. a dollar tree. And then she paints them whatever color she wants. These here are like a green color. Very pretty green. And then she'll like glue them together. Stack them on top of each other. Yeah, here's, here's a good one right here. Got an example right here. These are white, and then she'll put a uh, ribbon around it depending on what uh, season it is. And she can take this off, and when it comes Christmas time, whatever, and put green or red or whatever on it for different colors. And so she's going to do the same thing with these here. So, uh, what's your plans with these here, babe? These are going to be like. Uh, I, I'm going to do them just like those right there. Okay. Just change out the, the decorations on it for seasons. Gotcha. Um, like a fall. Yeah. Well, I don't know if these will work because yeah. of the color. Right. But this is mostly the colors in our house. Um, if you guys haven't noticed, I've redone the house in like greens and whites with uh, touches of uh, black. And so, um, yeah. 
I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't think, we'll see. Yeah, yeah. And as the holidays get closer and closer, she'll be doing all kind of uh, crafts. By the way, I got to show you some of the crafts that she made last year. Uh, I think you'll be pretty impressed. All right, well, let's start out with the shelf here. She made this shelf and uh, installed all the brackets and things and put on the wall. Then she also made this right here. This is a large picture frame where she put these uh, uh, fake sticks. They're fake, ain't they? Yeah, actually, that's a painter's canvas. A painter, that's right, you took off and the I canvas. And I took the canvas off of it. And right. just, um, I had some, um, some mulberry bush sticks. That's what that is. And I just gotcha. snapped them to different sizes and then hot glued them into the frame. So that's pretty cool right there. Yeah. Now look at this right here, guys. I'm gonna come right over here. See this uh, lantern? She made this lantern completely. I mean, look at that. How cool is that? I've got three of them. Yes, yeah, she's got three of them. And then here's another one over here. Look at this one here. This is a pretty large one. That's probably at least a foot tall or more. Yeah, it's not decorated right now. But yeah. Come fall, it will be, and then I'll decorate it for Christmas. Right. And then I, I, I made three of them. There's oh, one. yeah, here's another one down here. It's kind of dark down here. I don't have good lighting at all. I don't know if you can see that. I need to get a light. No, it's like the one up top. Up yeah, there. it's like the one up top. But yeah, I make those out of um, painter sticks and uh, cardboard, cardboard boxes. Cardboard boxes. Can you believe that? How cool is that? Look at that. Anyways, that's just a few of the crafts that Janita has made, and the panels in our bedroom. Oh yeah. I made those in the bedroom here. These panels that's on the wall, she made these here as well. So yeah, she's pretty crafty. <laughs> she's pretty crafty. So, and then, like I said, come holiday time, she'll be making all kinds of crafts. So uh, that's probably other things sitting around that she's made that uh, I'm missing. But anyway, I just want to show that to you. I think it's pretty awesome. If you see it in person, you would definitely think she bought these items. All right, I hear Janita in the ki in the kitchen here. <laughs> She's got a pot of beans right here. Yep. What are you making right here, babe? I don't have buttermilk to make cornbread, so I'm making my own buttermilk. Oh, and how do you do that? About one cup of milk to about a tablespoon of vinegar, and you let it sit for five minutes, and it starts what? to hang it up. Really? There ain't no butter in it? No, you know what buttermilk is. <laughs> What? Do you know what buttermilk what is? What is buttermilk? Buttermilk is what comes off the cream when you make butter. The the liquid. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's buttermilk. Like the cream like we, we shake and make our own butter. Yes. And the liquid is butter. Milk. Gotcha. From and the cream. From the cream. I don't have time to shake a jar to make yeah. buttermilk, so I'm just doing it this way. But yeah, it'll start it'll start thickening up and curly, curdling and... All that kind of good fun stuff. We'll have nice. buttermilk cornbread. We're having cowboy dinner tonight. Is that what it's called? I don't know what you call it. It's beans and cornbread. Beans and cornbread and onion and chow chow and yeah. I eat chow chow with my beans. Chow chow. That I make myself. Chow chow is kind of like a relish. If people don't know what that is, it's kind of like a relish. Um, it's pickled vegetables. Yeah, pickled vegetables, but it yeah. looks like a relish. It kind of tastes like relish. Yeah. Especially homemade. Yeah. Right there. Cabbage, green tomatoes, bell peppers, red peppers, yeah. jalapeno peppers, onions. Yeah. Yeah. Vinegar, salt, sugar. It's good stuff. Well, alrighty then. It, it is delicious in beans. Nice. But All yeah, right. we're going to have beans, beans, cornbread. Um, God, was that the floor? Or is that, oh, you're wearing those shoes. Yeah. Again. Something wrong with your shoes. <laughs> it's time for, I got these shoes, long story these shoes, but anyway, they're one of the cheapest but most comfortable shoes that I've found. Mm-hmm. They're sticky. 
Well, they wore out the, the bottom of this shot, but I keep on wearing them because they're so comfortable. Is that the one you got the fish hook in? This one I got the fish hook in yesterday, kind of ripped the bottom of the shield. Oh, that's funny. Uh, but anyway, for dinner, for those that want to know, um, uh, beans, cornbread, beans, and I'm going to slice cornbread, up uh, beans, some cornbread. cucumbers and some tomatoes and some onions. Okay. So. Well, all right then. Well, guys, appreciate you spending the day with us. Um, Janita did a whole lot of cleaning again in the back room, as you saw. I appreciate her doing that. It's all straightened out, organized, and uh, she cleaned it like crazy. Smells a whole lot better, too. I went in there while I go, I was like, Man, it smells good in here. <laughs> and what did I say? You said, That's what happens when you clean. That's what happens when you clean. But, anyways, guys, hey, appreciate you watching the channel. Hit that subscribe button if you like this video. Thumbs up if you uh, like it. That helps to uh, put it out to YouTube. It helps to put it out there to more people when you hit the thumbs up. But uh, guys, hey, I appreciate it. And as always, go for your dreams. Take, Take that leap of faith. And jump. <laughs> we'll see you next time. <laughs>